so how are you doing guys this is uh, a video i made after the course is complete because many people were getting this error when they try to create a facebook login so um it says insecure login blocked you can't access you can't get an access token or login to this app from an insecure page try loading the page as https so this basically means that you are running into a problem in which um, your local host doesn't have a certain certificate called um, CA certificate for CURL. So I'm going to show you how to set it up. All right. So you have to go and download it. And now we. Um, this is one page. Basically, what we're looking for is this. Look at it. CASAT.pen. So. Uh, I'll try and put the link to this page on it. Otherwise, just um, search or go to your browser and search for how to install CSR.pm in php.ini. So when you search this, you will see one of the pages describing this process. But this is the one I just have open now. So we're going to download this. You click on it once to download it. Downloads on your system. I've clicked on mine. So as you can see, I've downloaded mine. I've downloaded this several times. So I'm just going to copy one of them. Uh, right click and copy. So once you download yours, you can just click on um, copy it. If you download yours, you can just click on this, click on show folder, sh show in folder, then you'll see it and copy it. So once you copy it, we're going to start try and install it inside our PHP. So go to your WAMP server or whatever server you're using, XAMPP server or whatever server then um, go to the folder so that's one way of um, looking for where we're going to so you can just go to WAMP 64 or WAMP whatever you have here just go a step back above your folder here go to bin so inside bin you will see PHP inside PHP you will now see uh, all the PHP versions that are inside your your server, you understand. So, um, whatever server you're using, go to the 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 PHP folder. You will see all the PHP versions available. Then you can paste it, csf.p, and paste it there. Then you start from the lowest version, which is five point anything. You go into that. Go to your php.ini. Look at the file we're looking for. You open it with Notepad. So open with Notepad. Now it's open. First of all, you, we want to note where our csat.info file is um, saved. So we'll go back a step back. Look at the file here, and it is saved here. Look at if you click on this address bar, you can then copy this address bar. You see .php. Then we are pointing to csat.pn. All right. So here we're we're going to look for .info ca.info that is what we're looking for we search oh, sorry maybe i made a mistake in the name so we're gonna go back um, so i got it so inside this php.ini file you, you do ctrl f on your keyboard to pop this up so we're searching for call.car info this is cacurl.carinfo we'll click next then it shows you where it is on your on your on your file you will see in your own case if you're having that error you will see that there is this semicolon here this means comment it's like using this in php you understand it means this line is commented out so you have to remove this um, you remove this semicolon and then make sure you have this in your in your own so uh, let's say let me just comment this out in your own case you will have exactly something like this curl.ca.info so what you should do is step number one you remove this step number two you equate it to this then you come inside and paste the url we copied remember in the folder we copied the url to this look at we copied this because it points to this file we pasted here so make sure you paste it outside so all your all your php um, versions can access it so once i, I copied that and pasted here i now have to tap the 
type the exact name of the gcc is search.pn so uh, you put slash ca search.pn and you're good you understand so once you do this you're you're good to go so um your 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 file is like this you save it once you save uh, you do it for the next php version in this case we're looking for php.ini uh, open with not bad control f curl dot car info you see i've already done it for this one good and uh, mistake there is no semicolon at the end sorry no semicolon at the end sorry so you do it for this one no semicolon then you do it for the third php version too so make sure you do it for everything all right so after doing it for all the php versions that you have you have to restart your server so let me just confirm this control c a dot info all dot car info you see i've done it for this one too so make sure you do it for all the php versions if you do it for some it will not work well so after doing it for all the versions you have to come and restart your server so you come to your server right click close it exit and restart the server so once the server comes back online you will not have that um, error again all right so thank you very much uh, let me know if you have any questions don't forget to drop the questions uh, on the question section of the udemy course the, the title of the udemy course is laravel 5.5 masterclass very comprehensive see you guys thank you